Pasambayan ang Pilipino. The Philippine Dragon Boat Federation is bringing home seven medals following the World Championships. Leon Casaliejo is in Tampa, Florida with this story. From the cheering in the sidelines, the Filipinos were already winners. Kababayans from all over America traveled to support our PDBF team, competing in their final event in the World Championships, the 500-meter men's premier small boat class. The Philippines was in heat one, up against Japan and Trinidad and Tobago. From the starting horn, the Pinoys came out smoking, picking up speed with every stroke. They widened their lead in the halfway mark and was pretty much all alone in the finish line to top the heat. Yeah! Heat 2 had Australia, Italy and Puerto Rico with a top finisher automatically advancing to the finals with the Philippines. Australia proved to be the best of the group. <laughs> The four losing teams went to the semi-final round, with the top two joining the Philippines and Australia in the finals. <laughs> Filipinos were all over the venue waving Philippine flags and determined to be the loudest cheering squad. The Pinoy paddlers gave it their all in the final, up against Australia, Japan and Italy. They led from the start and never looked back. The Philippines crossed the finish line first, taking their fifth gold medal in the World Championships. The Filipino community celebrated. Other teams applauded the Philippines as well. Oh, great. This is for all the Filipinos. Masaya, masaya kami yun kasi yung target namin mamis nakuha namin yung five goals. Masweep namin lahat ng ano na kailangan namin makuha. Together with their supporters, the PDBF team gathered to pray and thank God for the amazing strength throughout the World Championships. The Padres were elated at their five gold, two silver medal output from the biggest, most prestigious Dragon Boat competition in the world. Coaches from other powerhouse teams, USA and Canada, were all praises for our team. I don't think they're physically any different. I think they just commit to a high level of training, a uh, high level of fitness, and they're able to sustain a stroke rate that uh, we don't even attempt at in the U.S. <laughs> yes. oh, you guys are famous. You yeah, have a like phenomenal team. Yeah, yeah. You have a YouTube video of the men in Macau. And I think every Canadian who paddles have, has seen that video and is just in awe of you guys. And if back in the Philippines, the team had to dive for tahong to eat, here they had an abundance of food contributed by the Filipino groups. They had so much they could even feed paddlers from the other nations who wanted to try Filipino cuisine. <laughs> Filipinos joined their voices to sing the national anthem at the medal ceremonies. Proud of the achievement, the fruit of hard work and unity. <laughs> The PDBF team is proud to be coming home with five gold medals and two silvers. And the team promises to work even harder to continue to make a name for the Philippines in the sport of Dragon Boat. Diane Castillejo, ABS-CBN News, Tampa, Florida.